Hello everyone. Namaskaram. In today's video, we will continue with the same chapter. The topic of today's video is pressure. Before that, let us first learn a new term known as thrust. A force can be applied on a surface in any direction. But if the force is acting normally, normally means perpendicularly, on a surface, then such force is called thrust. So we can say that thrust ek force hi hai. The only difference is that thrust wo force hai jo ki perpendicularly kisi surface par lag raha hai. Agar force perpendicular ke alawa kisi or direction mein lagta hai, then we will call it as just force. But agar force perpendicularly lagta hai, then we will call it thrust. When a body is placed on a surface, obviously it will exert a force on the surface which will be equal to its own weight. But since the force will be perpendicular, so we will say that the body is exerting a thrust on the surface equal to its own weight. Means, jab bhi koi body ek surface par rakhi jati hai, to वो अपने वजन के बराबर का फोर्स उस सरफेस पर लगाती है और टू बी मोर प्रिसाइज वो अपने वजन के बराबर का थ्रस्ट उस सरफेस पर लगाती है सो नाउ वी आर रेडी टू अंडरस्टैंड द टर्म प्रेशर द इफेक्ट ऑफ फोर्स ऑन अ गिवन एरिया इज कॉल्ड प्रेशर the thrust acting per unit area is called pressure. So in the given example, the thrust which the body was applying on the surface, if we divide that thrust by the area on which it was applied, then we will get to know the amount of force or thrust which is acting in a unit area. And this amount of thrust which is acting on a unit area is then called as pressure. Unit area means the area will be 1 cm square or 1 meter square or 1 millimeter square. Anything whose magnitude is 1 will be known as unit area. So we can say कि यूनिट एरिया में जितना थ्रस्ट लगता है उसी को हम प्रेशर कहते हैं यूनिट एरिया यानी कि वन मीटर स्क्वायर वन सेंटीमीटर स्क्वायर और वन एनीथिंग सो हाउ डिड वी ऑप्टेन प्रेशर हियर व्हाट वी हैव डन वी हैड डिवाइडेड द थ्रस्ट और द फोर्स बाय द एरिया देयरफॉर द फॉर्मूला ऑफ प्रेशर इज फोर्स अपॉन एरिया or we can call thrust upon area. So P equals to F upon A, where P is the pressure, F is the applied force or the thrust and A is the area of the surface on which the thrust is acting. Let us now learn the units in which the pressure is measured. We had learned just now that pressure is equal to force upon A. The unit of the SI unit of force is Newton and the SI unit of area is meter square. So the SI unit of pressure is Newton per meter square. This Newton per meter square is known as Pascal in honor of French physicist Blaise Pascal. So we can say that the SI unit of pressure is 
पास्कल और न्यूटन पर मीटर स्क्वायर बोथ आर सेम वन न्यूटन पर मीटर स्क्वायर इक्वल्स टू वन पास्कल वी हैव लर्नड दैट प्रेशर इक्वल्स टू फोर्स अपॉन एरिया सो वी कैन से दैट प्रेशर डिपेंड्स ऑन टू फैक्टर्स द फर्स्ट इज द फोर्स और द थ्रस्ट एंड द सेकेंड इज द एरिया लेट इस नाउ अंडरस्टैंड हाउ इफ वी डिवाइड टेन बाय टू एंड देन वी डिवाइड ट्वेल्व बाय टू विच विल गिव द ग्रेटर रिजल्ट obviously 12 by 2 so we can say that greater the numerator the greater will be the result so is the case with the pressure force is in the numerator side so if force is more then pressure will be more so we can say that on increasing the force or the thrust the pressure increases let us now take another example If we divide ten by two, and then we divide ten by five, then which will give the greater result? Obviously, ten by two. So we can say that greater the denominator, the lesser is the result. Now, since area is in the denominator side, we will say that on increasing the area the pressure decreases let us now conclude the whole thing we will say that pressure depends on two factors the thrust applied and the area how on increasing the thrust the pressure increases while on increasing the area of the surface the pressure decreases now we will apply this information in some practical examples we will see some practical examples related to pressure in the upcoming videos till then read the chapter well and try solving the questions so that's all for today we will proceed with the legacy of learning in the upcoming videos and continue this chapter further so thank you everyone for being here have a good day